And with possibly the steal of the draft, Bill Belichick lands Christian Gonzalez at pick 17 after trading back with the Pittsburgh Steelers. Welcome in to Chat Sports. Matthew Peterson here breaking down this draft pick for New England. We're going to get you guys familiar with the new starting outside corner opposite of John Jones, Christian Gonzalez out of Oregon. Now, he was, in my opinion, the number two cornerback in this class. So I'm a little surprised to see him go not in that order. But Christian Gonzalez, ladies and gentlemen, might you look back at this draft and think, wow. Talk about all-time value getting a legit starting corner at pick 17. You can make an argument he's the best cornerback in this draft class, maybe even ahead of Devin Witherspoon. Now, here is the scouting report on Gonzalez. Impressive athlete, probably doesn't do it justice. He ran a 4-3-8-40, and he's six foot two essentially. You don't find that combination of size and speed in cornerbacks every year in the draft. This is an extremely rare blend of awesome speed and great length for a cornerback. The only maybe knock he has is he's an outside corner. Don't put him in nickel. It's not going to work. He's going to be a great outside man-to-man -man corner. He might not be putting players on an island. He's got above average ball skills, maybe not elite tracking ability, but very good instincts. But you are drafting traits here. You are drafting a six foot two. 43840 cornerback. I love this pick for New England. Now, it was made possible because of this trade with Pittsburgh, right? They bounced back from 14 to 17 and also picked up a fourth round pick. So now the Patriots have all the picks in this draft. They got 120 from the Steelers. The big question will be should they have gone wide receiver? Should they have gone Jackson Smith and Jigba? And as we record this right now, no wide receivers have been taken. I am sure that's going to change by the time you're watching this. But we heard that this receiving class was a bit underwhelming, and the GMs are telling us that right now. But Gonzalez is the pick for the Pats. So grade it for me. A, B, C, D, or F. It's an A-plus pick for me. It really is. I think this is a home run selection for New England. When you take into account the value, a 17th overall pick – doesn't always get you a no-doubt first-round type of talent. In this case, I am sure that Bill Belichick was shocked that Christian Gonzalez was still available at 17. Now, the Athletics' Dane Brugler does great write-ups on all the prospects, and here's what he said on Gonzalez. Gonzalez needs continued work in zone coverage, but he offers strong man-cover man talent with speed, fluid movements, and body length to blanket outside receivers. With his high-end traits similar to Jeff Okuda and trust in his talent, he has the skill set of a future pro bowler. And when I think about what the Patriots need in this draft, you can make a lot of good arguments for wide receiver, but you can also point out the AFC East has guys like Josh Allen, Aaron Rodgers, and Tua. So you are facing not bad quarterbacks six times a year. So for New England, it was a little bit about slowing down Six games worth of elite, good, above-average quarterback play, wherever you want to toss Tua in there. And that was accomplished with getting Christian Gonzalez, right? You had the 14th pick in the draft. You move back to 17. You get an extra fourth rounder because why not? But you land Christian Gonzalez. Guys, he is going to be a Pro Bowl corner. I will sort of plant my flag in the mountainside and say that right now. Christian Gonzalez might be my favorite pick of this draft. Because I thought he could go top five, top six, top seven, right there in the middle of the top 10 picks, and somehow he falls to 17. I don't know if Gonzalez just whored around all last night and slept with every GM's wife except for BB, but somehow he fell to 17, and the Patriots get the ultimate steal of the draft, in my opinion. So make sure to subscribe if you're not already. We're trying to grow this Patriots channel so we can get more attention, a full-time host. And if you want more free Patriots YouTube content, hit that sub button down below. Now getting back to Christian Gonzalez, 51 career, excuse me, career, 51 tackles in 2020, uh, 2022, four interceptions and seven pass breakups. If someone says his weakness is ball skills, 
and he still put up four interceptions, clearly it's not that bad, right? We're talking about a former four-star recruit for the Oregon Ducks who had a lot of great time in Eugene. We're talking about a first-team All-Pac-12 player. He led the Oregon Ducks in interceptions last year, past breakups as well. He even blocked a field goal. You're getting a good special teamer for crying out loud as well. Originally from the Dallas area, he's not one of those grandpas in this draft either. 21 years old, he came out as a junior. He's six one and a half more or less. Buck 97, maybe you can put on a few more pounds, but honestly, weight's not a concern for me. Our draft expert at Tom Downey had him as the seventh best player in this draft. So to find him at 17, that's an all-time value right there. For New England now, you got to imagine that in round two, they're going to be targeting wide receiver. And maybe guys they did not think would escape the first round, like Jordan Addison, or maybe he's already picked by the time you're watching this, or Quinton Johnston, they are available in round two. But for the Patriots, I have to envision they came in with a plan, and that plan did not include Christian Gonzalez being available at 17. So when they saw him on the board still, they ran that ticket in as soon as they could. Now, I want to know from everyone watching before we get on out of here, who do you want the Patriots to draft next now, right? Who is your guy in round two? Or is it a trade back into round one at the very end? Give me a name down below in the comment section. If you can't think of one, how about this one? Josh Downs, wide receiver from UNC in round two tomorrow. But Christian Gonzalez, you are a New England Patriot. This Patriot secondary has a lot of good pieces in it. But I think Gonzalez might be the heartbeat of it in a few years. He's a great leader. He's an awesome guy to have in your locker room. He's going to become a fan favorite, in my opinion. And you got him at 17 when he should have been picked at 6, 7, or 8. I love this pick for New England. It's by far already my favorite pick in terms of value for an NFL team in this draft. That is it for today's show. Make sure to subscribe if you enjoy today's breakdown of this draft selection. Feel free to subscribe down below in the comment section. Give us a like, all that YouTube cliche. It just helps grow our Patriots channel so that way more Patriots fans can find it and we can get more videos out to all of New England.